Hi, welcome to WebNIC SSL WHMCS Module Installation Guideline video. There will be four parts. This is part one, and it guides you in uploading WebNIC SSL add-on module file to your hosting server. In this tutorial, we will use Plesk to install it. If your hosting server interface is using cPanel or others, the flow of installing the module is similar. Let's get started. First, log in to the WebNIC reseller panel and click the API Configuration tab in the menu bar on the left side. Wait for the page to load. After loading, click the WHMCS Platform tab. Then, download the WebNIC SSL add-on module by clicking the Download button. Make sure the zip file is completely downloaded. Next, proceed to the back end of your hosting and log in to your hosting account as usual. In Plesk, the first thing we need to do is upload the zip file through the file manager. Click the Files button on the left menu bar to open the File Manager page. You can choose to upload the zip file to any folder which is under Home Directory. To upload, select the folder and click the Upload button. Then, locate the WHMCS underscore SSL dot zip file that you downloaded from the reseller panel just now and click Open. We recommend uploading the zip file to the TMP folder. After the zip file upload is completed, tick the box beside the file and click the Extract Files button. Then, you will see the WebNIC SSL add-on module folder. Next, open it and you'll see three folders, Lang, Modules, and Templates. These are the folders we need to copy to the WHMCS folder. First, we copy the Lang and the Templates folder to the HTTP Docs folder. Don't forget to tick Replace Existing Files before clicking the OK button. Next, open the Modules folder. You will see three different folders of the PHP version here. Before copying, make sure to check your hosting's PHP version first. Go back to the dashboard and check the PHP version. You can see it beside PHP settings, which in our case is v7.2.27. After checking the PHP version, go back to the modules folder just now. Open the folder which is your hosting server's PHP version and click into the WSSL folder. Tick modules in it and copy to the HTTP docs folder. Remember to tick Replace Existing Files before clicking the OK button. Congratulations! We have completed all steps. So, let's do a check now to make sure all the folders can be found inside the HTTP Docs folder. The first folder we are going to check is the Modules folder. So, let's go to the HTTP Docs folder, then the Modules folder, then the Add-ons folder. Make sure that there is a WebNIC folder in here. Then, go back to the Modules folder. Next, open the Servers folder and scroll down until you see the WSSL folder. You need to make sure that these two folders must be in the Modules folder. The second folder we're going to check is the Lang folder. Go back to the HTTP Docs folder, then open the Lang folder, then open the Overrides folder. Make sure these three language files are here. The last folder we are going to check is the Templates folder. Go back to the HTTP Docs folder, then open the Templates folder, then open the Order Forms folder. Make sure the WebNIC SSL folder is here. Well done! Part 1 of the installation guideline is completed. Let's continue to Part 2 which guides you on activating the WebNIC SSL WHMCS module and importing WebNIC SSL products into your WHMCS.